The first day of a new beginning. Hey mom, I'm off to school. Oh, Kelly, sweetie, have an amazing day. Are you walking to school today? Oh yeah, it's just two blocks away and it's really nice outside, so I'll be walking. All right, honey, I love you. Love you too, mom. All right, class, before we start today, I have a special announcement to make. Although I do not know where the special pet is. So, so sorry, I am late, Miss Blue. Oh, that is perfectly fine. It is your first day after all. Everyone, I'd like you to meet Callie. She is a new student in our class today. She will be with us here for the rest of the year. Callie, you may introduce yourself to the class. Oh, um, hi everybody. My name is Callie. I'm from the countryside and I can't wait to start learning with you guys. Did she say from the countryside? Aren't there like really dirty pets over there? All right, Callie, that was a beautiful introduction. Please uh, sit in the back over there with Stephanie, who is on her phone. Please get off your phone, Stephanie. <sighs> Fine, Mrs. Blue. Go on, Callie, take a seat. We will begin the lesson shortly. So get yourself acquainted with the students. Thank you so very much. <sighs> oh, I'm um, hi, I'm Callie. Yeah, I heard you, Big Hoof. Um, okay. Uh, hey, Callie. Yeah? Do you know what that is on Stephanie's desk? It's a phone, right? Or are you joking? <laughs> You're pretty smart for a cow. Um, geez, she doesn't know what you're talking about, man. Actually, I do. I'm very good at English. Really? You don't look like it. Most of the cows I've encountered aren't very good. <laughs> Those circles on your fur. Look really funny. You kind of look like a pepperoni pizza. <laughs> Good one. <laughs> um, I mean, I do like pizza. That's surprising. I didn't think they had pizza in the countryside. No, I thought you cows ate grass. How does grass taste, by the way? Pretty good, actually. <laughs> Callie, you are so stupid you can't even see an insult when one is given. <laughs> yeah. Maybe that big nose of yours is in the way of uh, your intelligence. <laughs> Welcome to our school, Callie the cow. <laughs> cow. Sounds funny, doesn't it? Cow. Okay, shut up, it's getting annoying. I, uh, thanks. I wonder what they meant by all that. Hey, what did she just say now? Oh, I don't know. I was a little too busy staring at Callie's fur. It's a weird texture, isn't it? Yeah, it doesn't look soft at all. Kind of strange. Yeah, I kind of feel bad for her. I mean, I would never want to look like that. Me either. Aren't you not supposed to be texting in class? Um, excuse me, Callie, mind your own business? Stephanie, go to the office. I told you five times already to stop texting in class. Don't you remember before Callie came over there? Oh, yeah, I told her that she should stop. Stephanie, go to the office. You filthy hamburger, you're such a snitch. Filthy hamburger. Oh. Stephanie! Oh my dog, Kelly, are you okay? Do you need to go to the nurse? No, I'm fine. All right, just let me know, okay? I'll give you a pass to go to the nurse or, you know, to get a break from this classroom if you need it. Thank you so much. Of course. Oh, she left her phone. Don't you dare. Try and seal it, beef patty. I wasn't planning on it.
Oh my dog, Stephanie, I can't believe you ordered burgers. Yeah, shoving it in her face, this is what she deserves. She's eating that dry, unseasoned lettuce. Because of her, I have detention after school. Smell it. Smell it, Callie. <laughs> Callie, sweetie. I just made your favorite pumpkin pie in honor of your first day. How did it go? Oh, um, it went okay, Mom, I guess. What do you mean okay? It should have been amazing. Well, I don't know. It was just kind of weird. I mean, the pets there, they all asked strange questions and kind of laughed at me. I think it's because we're from the countryside. You know, because it's different there and... We didn't use much technology, and they also laughed at my spots. Your spots? Yeah, my spots. And my hooves. And my fur. I don't really know why, though. I must contact her school. That should not be tolerated just because you are different. They don't seem to be used to pets like me. I've only seen cats and dogs there. Yes, the diversity of animals there aren't the greatest, but we are making a change in that school, honey, because we are cows. Cows are often perceived as, well, dirty, not knowing much about technology, we may look funny to them, but we are all animals. And I want you to know, honey, that no matter what any pet says, you are beautiful. Beautiful as a cow. Spots and all, hooves and all, fur and all. And because you are different, that makes you special. And it makes you beautiful. I hope you aren't too saddened by this. I mean, it happens to cows all the time. This is just your first time experiencing the ignorance of what us cows go through. It will get better though, honey. Thank you, mom. Thank you a bunch. Maybe I can talk to the pets and change their minds about me, you know? Oh, Kelly, you aren't the issue here. It's the other pets that are the issue. Yes, their minds need to change, but you don't need to change yourself to change their minds. They need to be open-minded and see that there are so many different types of pets all over the world. You happen to be a cow. And you happen to be a cow attending an all cat and dog school. Yeah, you're right. I was going to, I don't know, say something to change their minds about me, but I guess trying to convince them with not so honest words and words pertaining to their liking isn't the best option. I just want this whole experience to be better, simpler, you know, Mom? Yes, but sometimes we need to face hardships to get the equality and, well, kindness towards us cows. You should not be treated any differently because you are a cow, understand? Yeah. I understand. All right, Callie. Let's eat these pies. And if you have any other questions, just let me know. Mom? Yes, Callie? Do you think I can get other cows to join the school as well? Maybe, I don't know, recommend it to them or something. Maybe we have some family coming over here. That'd be a lovely idea, Callie. Okay, that sounds great. I'm going to make a change.
Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Hannah, or you can call me Casey Films. And I hope you all enjoyed this short film. I know it was a little sad with the bullying and all, but hopefully Callie goes off and helps the school out with its diversity and bringing more cows into the school and all sorts of types of pets. I did make a film, a two-part film actually, about discrimination against the LPS cows. Um, it's one of my favorite films I've made on this channel. It hasn't gotten a lot of love. I hope this one does because I feel like this one goes more into the, um, I guess you could say bullying aspect. My other film was about a writer and she was discriminated against because I guess the um, dog thought she was stupid and dirty and all that, which um, tied into this one as well because everybody was saying, oh, Callie smells because she's a cow and she's stupid because she's from the countryside. But um, yeah, this is a metaphor for racism actually in the world. Um, I would hope you would have figured that out by now. That also for um, the new calf in the city, that's the film. The link will be in the description box below. I'll also put it in the iCard at the top. But yeah, I just wanted to speak about that, you know, of course, still, still guys, I, I've, been, I've talked about it before, but you know, Black Lives Matter, though, they matter every single day, every single year, every single week, every single month. And I don't want you all to forget that I'm not sure what the majority of my viewers are in race aspect, but I am an African American. I am mixed and it really does hurt to see so many black lives just not receiving the justice they need and this the discrimination and there's just so much fear and it's really sad and it just it's awful and i really want everybody to realize that and i know a lot of you guys are young but i think it's really good to see that you know not everybody has it perfect I love to express my YouTube videos in a sense where I can show them in a not really lighter aspect but show them in a way you guys can understand and hopefully you guys can better yourselves whether it's from the LGBTQ plus community whether it's like discriminating against them I don't want you guys to do that um, I want everybody to be loved whether it's like if you have a disability or your race but um yeah I just want to you know also make those who feel like they're unwelcomed welcomed at my channel you know i don't care your, what your race is your sexuality your identity your financial status um i don't care if you have a disability or not this channel is for everybody and i want you all to realize that and i hope i can bring in everybody who is different on this channel we can all love each other and be very kind to each other so yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this film let me know if you like films like this i don't see many lps tubers making films surrounding this idea and i don't think lps tube is as diverse as it should be um at least from what i've seen with popular lps tubers you know but i'm hoping you know i can change that i can inspire you know black people who want to make LPS videos to make LPS videos or anybody of any other type of race because I think this community should be more diverse and I think that we all should express ourselves in the way we want to with our cultures and our identities and just everything about that. I know this outro is really long but I just wanted to say all that because I really do love you guys and I love how different you all are and I just really want to spread the love on this community and if you can please sign petitions and donate to everything surrounding black lives matter and if you even see any other like issue in the world just please sign a petition it really helps out and share it it's great to know what's going on around the world and how you can help even if you're young because age doesn't matter when you're trying to make a difference in the world but thank you guys so much for watching this film i love you guys so much like i've already said um don't forget to click the links in the description down below um subscribe if you aren't already i'd really appreciate that and please turn on the bell notification so you get notified when i upload a new video i'll see you guys in my next youtube video also i don't know if i've shown you my nails but these this is what all my, is on my nails um I have leaves on them. I am going to change them tomorrow, but you know, I just thought they were cute and I'd like to show you them. I also have another channel where I showcase AliExpress nail art hauls I do, and hopefully someday I can do um, actual nail art on there, but I don't have an upper head tripod. But anyway, thank you for watching again. 
I hope you have an amazing day. And let me know if you're um, a black LPS tuber, I would like to know because I haven't seen many around and it'd be nice to connect with you guys and such. But uh, yep, see you guys in my next YouTube video. Goodbye, 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 goodbye. <laughs>